Yeah, well, uh, Inside Investor is best summed up through our mission and our vision, which is to become a global leader in uh, business intelligence and provide that intelligence to the investment community. And we do so through a number of different verticals, through events, through media, and through consultancy. So it was like three years ago. And now after all the successes in Malaysia, in Sarawak, uh, Philippines, Singapore, Thailand, now that's why we are here in Brunei, to give them the same opportunity as well. To help promote foreign direct investment, what we do is we collaborate through our investment platforms and our networking, and you know, that's where the consultancy side comes in because we, we want to we want to be the medium of choice for these governments to facilitate investment and deal flow just to make it as easy as possible for them, which is where we get into our webinars, for example, as opposed to having these major governments travel from country to country because it, it is difficult to get you know, 50 people all in one spot for a three-day span as opposed to just having a webinar where they can be in their home office or in, in their house or in their bedroom if they, if they choose. Um, and you know, it, it makes it easier for them, so that's what, that's what we like. LNG, you know, natural gas, for example, really decreases the carbon footprint. So that's definitely, you know, focused towards clean energy and clean energy. Wind and solar energy is, is, is a major, major you know, marketing tool just because, you know, it kind of it expands on the corporate social responsibility that a lot of these oil and gas companies have. Um, you know, they have a responsibility to promote the clean use of energy. Um, and agriculture, I mean, food processing, the halal market, um, all of these have been tapped into but haven't been promoted, and you know, there's a lot of research and development going on that... Um, About yeah. bringing multinational companies yeah, into yeah. Brunei as well. Okay, well, uh, what we have been, been doing so far, for example, with Sarawak, I mean, we brought all the um, Sarawak delegation into Qatar last October. We had an event in, in Qatar. It was under the patronage of the Prime Minister of Qatar. We had the former Secretary General of ASEAN, Dr. Suvin Pitsuan. So, I mean, what we do is to keep these people together and get things moving. So now, for example, Qataris are going into Sarawak. We facilitated a meeting between the Prime Minister of Qatar and Sarawak Chief Minister in order to pitch him about the investment opportunities in Sarawak. So, I mean, this is what we want to do with Brunei, to promote Brunei as one of the main countries in the Southeast Asian region. That's one of the biggest challenges in Brunei, you know, that we are new for them. We have already done our research about Brunei last year with our publication Inside Asia in 2012, but it was like a very short research. I mean, we have a very good research, but it was very quick. So. What we want to do now is to go further. So, yeah, this is, this is a challenge for us because we want to make people understand that mm, we are not focused just in publications. We have more than publications. Yeah, the, the, I mean, the big return on their investment is their time. It's not always a monetary value because we don't, you know, we want their time to be valued and we do value it. So we, we appreciate all the time we're, we're given here and mm -hmm. all the meetings we're given here. Um, but we also have you know, the consultancy side in our in network and our intelligence where we can keep these relationships going even if we are overseas or, you know, flight away. That's why we – that is a challenge in, you know, setting up shop here. But at the same time, we, we want to keep these relationships going like we have done with all the other governments that we've mm -hmm. worked with. We have been meeting with the Prime Minister's office, yeah. ministries like industry and primary resources, yeah. Department of Agriculture, then in the private sector, banks like Baidui Bank, VIBD, um, what else? Maybank, yeah. Mitsubishi Corporation, yeah. we are meeting Petronas tomorrow. Yeah, I mean, so they are being help, I mean, helpful. Mm -hmm. yeah, we're, we're, what we're trying to do is get insight from the main personnel personalities of Brunei mm -hmm. because you know they have the knowledge so so we want to do we want to get them into our network and into our intelligence and have them collaborate through us <laughs>